Welcome back. This is Hashtag Goa in the morning. I'm Brian Sankwen. As always, interact with us and let us know where you're watching us from. We're about to delve into an interesting topic about the tourist and travels industry. And uh, joining me live right now in studio, I have Ezra Bundi Mbo Obongo, who is the director as well at Bundi Safaris. Good morning to you. Good morning. Hey, how are you? We are good. Uh, Karibu sana. Asante sana. Why in the morning? This is Entrepreneurship Tuesday. We interview a lot of people that are in business, just mm -hmm. like you are. And uh, maybe just a brief story about your industry and maybe the reason why you decided to partake in that journey, especially in the tours and travels industry. Maybe do you have a, a story behind um, it? Yeah, sure. So, Jambo Kenya, my name is Ezra Bundi Obongo. I'm the director at Bundi Safaris. So, Bundi Safaris started 2021, September, that is. I remember after the, the coronavirus, the country was in a lockdown, yeah. total lockdown. Mm -hmm. And I remember that time we were curfew, so many people were, were indoors. Yeah. No, I, I came with an idea of uh, taking people. It was on a Sunday. I can't, I can't forget that Sunday. It was on a Sunday. I said, like, okay, I have some neighbors here, but we have been indoors for the longest time. So why should we go to? We should go to Ngong, Ngong Hills. That uh, we were just around uh, seven people. Yeah. From there, I started doing these Sundays, Sunday trip to Ngong, to Ngong, to Ngong Hills. Initial, after then, uh, something came. After now, the, the lockdown was, was over. People told me that, hey, we should go to a different location. And I suggested Namanga. So I planned, I planned. And uh, <laughs> to my surprise, that trip, I remember, I had the, the largest and the biggest number ever. I had almost like a 90, 90 clans. Mm. I did a biggest road trip that then. That was uh, September. No, it was around uh, yeah, November. We did right. to Namanga. Mm. Then after there, I came with any idea of registering a company yeah. to start tours and travel because I had that passion. Uh, which year? Uh, Again? 2021. Yeah, just after COVID, like yeah, when you were COVID, recovering yeah. from the pandemic. Yeah, sure. Right. And uh, maybe uh, are there like structures that you put in place that actually set you straight up on this path? Yeah, of course, you, you, you need to have a plan. In every business you do, you need to have a plan because mm. you, can't, you can't just enter into, into a world without any plan. So you need to do too much of uh, searching, too much of uh, uh, learning. And, uh, but for me, I had that passion because of I, have, I, am, I am a, I'm a hold of uh, hospitality. I did hospitality. Yeah. So I had that uh, vision and I had that passion yeah. of doing this thing I'm doing right now. Right. So oh, you studied for it in college? Yeah, but now I, I majored in food production. All right, but yeah. no, hospitality is a very it's large. Diverse, it's yeah. very large. Mm -hmm. Yeah, as long as you have that uh, that spirit of talking to a client, you can handle them very politely. You're yeah. good to go. Right. Yeah. Uh, so far, you're saying this. This is uh, how many years in business? Three. Three or, years. Three years or and counting. Two and a half. Oh, counting. Years, clocking yeah, counting. now. Three years. Yeah. Right. Maybe are there favorable, uh, also favorable conditions that have uh, helped your business to stay afloat in terms of, uh, now if you, uh, maybe we can delve a little bit further into the structure for tours and travels industry. And in short, even that whole docket, uh, uh, mm -hmm. let's not get into the cabinet secretary and what they're saying about mm -hmm. the whole thing. But mm -hmm. maybe what are some of the favorable conditions that have boosted your operations in line of your business? Okay. Uh, in hand, let me tell you, in every business, the government must play its role. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for tours and travel, uh, the, the government is trying because uh, when you see uh, leave leave alone these uh, these fees which have been increased this year uh, last year that is, but uh, the government of of course it does a little of advertising because uh, when when you see the magical Kenya, mm -hmm. when when having such a such a such a uh, such a call and right. when you go to maybe other other places like Mombasa you can see they have a good reception when you go maybe they have a bigger huge you can organize something. Mm -hmm. So a good, a, a good structure of the government has supported to, to build the, 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 whole, the whole company, the whole um, industry of tours and travel. Yeah. So, so for your company, is it a registered company? Yeah, it, it is. Oh, it's a registered, it company, a registered company, company. Meaning that you have all the documentations. Uh, uh, and maybe uh, you can briefly explain to someone who also wants to take on that journey, like how do you, how do you climb up the stairs in okay. that process? Yeah. Thank you. So when, when you have an idea, first of all, you, just, you, need, you need to go to register business name. Mm -hmm. After acquiring a business name, you need to go to this, um, uh, the carry to get your PIN. You need to have your uh, physical location of your office because you need to provide all those details. So mm -hmm. at least you can get the, the verification of a business. Right. But there you go for the business permit. Right. And then you go for, for if, uh, if maybe you have, you, have a, you have some capital maybe inside, you can go for right. the, mm -hmm. 
the Kenya, the IATA, you can register on those uh, agencies. You can at least, so at least your, your agents can be, be, yeah. be one, one of those in the, in the agent yeah. list. Right. So uh, let, let's say for, for, for your business, like for US, uh, what, what are some of the, let's say the basic ones that you have? <laughs> that you needed to start operations? The, the basic one because so as to at least you can have that uh, trust of clients because this, this business nowadays many, <laughs> many, uh -huh. many people have come, have opened many, yeah. many tours and travel. Right. You, you need to have a business name. Mm -hmm. You need to have a physical mm, office. Right. You need to have a, a very well and up website. Right. Yeah, you need to have a, you need to have a assistance in you know, your office, maybe sales representatives, you need mm -hmm. to have them. Your, your number of, of, the, of the company should be on 24-7. Right. So by that, I, I think, uh, can I say amount? Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, the business registration, yeah, that's I think a thousand bob, unless I can confirm, yeah, a thousand bob. Right. Then, uh, then you need to have a website, a website of course, is, uh, a little too, you need to go inside your pockets. Yeah. And then you need to have this business permit right. of, of, the, of the location, because mm -hmm. each, and every, each and every town has its own business permit. Yeah. Then, then you need to have all this uh, registration for the no agents, which are member of the Right. Yes. Right. Yeah, I think you're learning something. Hey, mm, yeah. You're keenly taking note. Now, <laughs> let's, let's, let's go back to your business still. Maybe yes. what were some of your early years of operations? Uh, how was it? How was the experience between uh, the invention of the business and mm -hmm. then you starting to operate between 2021, 2022, 2023 last year and mm -hmm. now this is another new year? Mm -hmm. Of course, uh, business, you know, a business is a risk, first of all. You know, when you, when you start a business, you must understand that business is a risk, is a risk-taking thing. So, in my, in my own opinion, uh, Booty Safaris, uh, we started, the, okay, each, each, and every, each and every season has a high and low peak. Yeah. Because that uh, sometimes uh, you can have a dip and then it slopes. Yeah. But it's normal because uh, maybe it, 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 uh, it's a low season. Yeah. So, yeah. So starting from 2021, we started well. Uh, 2022, it was uh, a bit, uh, a uh, little bit. Mm -hmm. And then uh, last year, it was amazing because uh, we, did, we did a lot of, a lot of tours last year. Right. And then uh, also 2022, around the end of 2022, it was fine. Yeah. Yeah. Because there's a time I took a break, I went to Qatar. That yeah. Is, yeah. So you took a break, no operations at all until you came I, back? I had some clients to take to the World Cup. So oh, that okay. period. So how was it? Who was running your business when you went to Qatar? I, I, I have the representative in the office. I have, uh, I have two ladies. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's like the whole number in the no, company? No, the, 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 the two ladies are, are the sales, are the sales uh, representatives. Uh -huh. and then I have, I have another drivers, then other, other people. Oh, in have. total, how many? In total, I have like uh, five. Uh -huh. Five, yeah, five. That have been employed with salaries guaranteed at the end yeah, of the month. Yeah, sure. All right. Mm. All right, that's interesting because, you know, the main, actually the main reason of mm -hmm. even entrepreneurship is to create opportunities, yeah, opportunities yeah. and innovation. Yeah, yeah, sure. So I think it's an incredible thing you're doing. Mm -hmm. Now, let's get part to uh, where you started, you know, receiving returns. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe you can point us uh, and take us to the journey. When did it start being beneficial and uh, how was the reception so far? And how do, what is the process that you took to ensure that this, uh, you've said five mm -hmm. that you have on board. Yeah. Uh, what is the criterion you used to actually also bring them on board? Did they also study uh, uh, tours and travel or that hospitality mm -hmm. docket as well? Am I too, is maybe a referral or a partnership or a networking system, if you can take us to the story. Okay, for, for tours, of course, uh, number one, I, I, I won't go behind the doors, I just tell the truth. In, uh, you know, tours and travel, you are being paid in commission based because uh, when you bring a client, at least you can do something. But all this came in networking and then uh, referrals, of course. And then if we can't employ anybody in your, in your company, you need to, to get a good referral from someone else unless the person you know. Mm. And then... Um, so how did you get these ladies that you have? Number one, referrals. And then number two, like uh, net networking because I met them. I met uh -huh. them before, before I gave them the opportunity. Right. At least I saw the effort. Yeah, because we, I must give you some trial. I see, okay, can you manage to do the ABCD? Yeah, yeah. you're like some sort of like an HR. So you are hiring <laughs> people. So you're like, oh, yeah. this one, your qualification, nah, da, da, da. Yeah. Yeah, because Take, uh, yeah. Uh, one, one, thing, one thing on this too that will let people to know, right. the best manager in your company is yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so never, 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 okay, you can give other people the opportunity to do, to do so, but at least those coming to your company, at least it's good to, to know them. 
yeah. know their strength, what can they deliver? Because you can't come and then do zero work. Yeah. Because in tours and travel, we, we depend on the, the number of clients we do have in a month. Yeah. For instance, maybe here we have a, a Mombasa trip. I, I will see like, how many, how many clients have you brought? Because of course you, you, have, you have a monthly salary, yeah. which, uh, which is a, uh, it's a, um, for instance, I can, I don't, can I say the number? Yeah, oh. sure, absolutely. Oh. You're free to sure. do as well as you can. <laughs> okay, of course, the, the lowest, the lowest uh, wage, that is like around 25,000. Mm -hmm. So from there, you yourself, you're the person to make it to 50,000 or 60,000, right. depending on the clients you're bringing on board, mm -hmm. depending on the, on the effort which you've brought to the company. Because yeah. from there now, I count it as your. Yeah. You so you're able home. to get commission from that? Yeah, for them now. That is oh, for, for them. them. Yeah, yeah, for them. Because now you're the boss here. Yeah, for them. <laughs> yeah, for for them. Uh, and no. then uh, you've asked again about uh, how it the returns. The returns they are, they are there, mm -hmm. because uh, when uh, when you have a good uh, planning for the tour, for for reason for travels and for this for tour maybe maybe you want to take someone to Masai Mara. You need to have a good plan, a good yeah. uh, a good uh, a good uh, itinerary. How how will you spend the, the money? Because uh, you, if uh, if you take a business and then spend it all and then that, that's not business if yeah. if you take a business there's no profit that's no business yeah yeah so you, you need to have a good a good uh, strategy good planning and good um, budget for your trips right yeah right good and so when did you fully start to enjoy the fruits of uh, this company uh, you've said last year you really had an amazing year yeah and i think uh, last year was also a good year for a lot of people yeah, as sure. much as people said it was a bad year yeah, yeah it, it was uh, the returns, the returns, the, the actually I can take you back. The first return I, I made it, uh, that trip I did to Namanga. Right. You see, the first, the first trip, mm. that, that in motivated me now to, to see, like, okay, yeah, this thing has a, has a good returns. Right. So from then, we had, we had some, uh, some good returns. Mm. And uh, also last year, because uh, as, I, as, I as I told you earlier, if you have a good plan, if, if you have a good, um, uh, budget planning for your clients mm. i'm telling you we must get a good return but right. if uh, you don't you don't do those uh, budget planning you go yeah. to a loss right and that's no business so right. for my for my businesses i do try uh, and I do, I do tell my my team that is good at least uh, when you do your budget be accurate with your budget right. because we don't want budgeting to yeah exactly budgeting is key mm. budgeting is key and then planning also is very key right yeah right which is an incredible thing because you know a lot of people just think I'll borrow some money from a bank and I start this to a no, 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 business. No. But also, did you do research and get to know like uh, how does the market operate, the ecosystem and the climate of your business? Did you maybe do an earlier research at first? Or sometimes it's also good to test the waters. Mm -hmm. You go blindly, you feel the pinch, and you learn mm -hmm. the hard way. And sometimes it's also good to come with you know a support record, like you know. I'm starting this, but I know my competitors, yeah. and this is what I should expect. Mm -hmm. These are the good times, these are the bad times. And also, how did you shield yourself from trying times? And also, maybe if you can also point out what are, what are those trying times that you guys endured. Okay, thank yeah. you. So, yeah, I will, te I will tell you, <coughs> it's a, th th this business has a, has, a, has, a lot of, has a lot of challenges, of right. course. It's has a lot of challenges. Sometimes, I've, I've told you, Mm -hmm. Before even I go to tell you that I did the research, because I, I said that earlier, I said uh, when you start any business, please understand the people, understand that environment, understand that industry. So for, my, for myself, I did a lot of research, and then I had that passion. Of course, I've traveled with different companies. I won't name them, but I've traveled with them. So no, I can't. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, so <laughs> I continue. Okay. So uh, I've traveled with big, big companies. Yeah. Uh, I should not name them, man. So I travel with them. I have done uh, many trips with them. So after then, I was like, I was learning like, okay, okay. So these things are done like this and this, like this and this and this and this. Because I had that passion, I had that call. Yeah. I remember even from when I was in college, yeah. we, we, I was uh, I was among the those people who were planning for these uh, outs. Mm -hmm. So it's something which which has been inside me. And then yeah. uh, you must do the research. You must go attend these uh, expos. You need yeah. to. Uh, attend these conferences, at least you learn. Are there any that you attended that inspired a lot? Yeah, the Magical Kenya Expo last year, I was right. there. Actually, mm -hmm. uh, uh -huh. okay. I've been, I've been, uh, there, there, there's another one coming uh, next week from Russia. I'll be there. Right. It's, it's good to, to get these networks. The and then and the experience. Yeah, they, right. exactly, yeah. Right. And then... Um, the most trying times? Of trying the times. Place. So, trying times, uh, mm, I would say 2022. Mm -hmm. 2022, yeah. 
2022, because uh, and even, even last year, 2023, early last year, because the year uh, that you also had an amazing year. <laughs> no, no, they, they start sometimes. Oh, the, you the start other, the, the beginning <laughs> of last year. Oh, yeah, okay. exactly. Okay. Yeah, so uh -huh, they they try. Of course, each and every business has its own. Uh, can I say low, mm. low times? Yeah. You understand. And what were yours? Your mine, uh, mine, mine were um, the the trips were flopping because. Uh, uh, yeah. some, sometimes, let me tell you something, because nowadays, when uh, there are many businesses uh, about the tours and travel, many mm. companies have come, others I don't know if, <laughs> if someone wakes up in the morning and then, no, yeah. you see, having that uh, consistency and trusting of the people. Remember, I took a break 2022, which is almost like four months, three months. Mm. So, and my team alone, uh, they were also struggling because I was... Of challenges are very, you know, when the the horse is not around. <laughs> yeah, mm. yeah, challenges. Mm. So yeah, we do we do have trying times, but uh, so far so good. Mm. We are here. And how and did you recover? God. Recover, believing in yourself, believing, and then, uh, of course, don't forget the purpose of why you started it. Mm. When you lose the purpose, when you lose the focus, and then mm. you'll be lost. Right. Don't forget the purpose. Don't forget what motivated you to start. Yeah. Yeah. So that that has always been been me. Right. Sometimes, uh, of course, uh, it's it's not the the money from the company. Sometimes you need even to to sacrifice your own right. because you need the company to run. Mm. Yeah. Are there things you've sacrificed now that you put that across? Yeah. Okay. S sacrificing comes comes with a lot of things because uh, even time time is yeah yeah maybe you can go to. Other business because I, I, do, I don't deal with the safaris only business. I do have other businesses. So wow. from other businesses, at least preparing. But this was the was the father. So right. when when the father is down, the babies mm -hmm. are they come yeah. and I get do it. something. Yeah. Yeah. I have two questions before we please, switch please. to another uh, uh, another trajectory. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe in terms of operations, uh, how do you conduct operations at your facility that enable you to reach out to your clientele? Mm -hmm. And then also you can talk about your clientele base and how is your customer relations with your client. Okay, um, hmm. our our structure is uh, is simple because uh, we we do we do have a uh, the, the of course the manager, we do have the the sales representatives, we do have the customer service, uh, and then um, our number is always on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in case so you uh, have a toll free number e online. Uh, not not oh, just free. a normal number. <laughs> yeah, yeah. they're normal number, oh. but a very simple number because right. zero two zero two zero two 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 zero, and then zero uh, seven zero four five six two. Okay. Any time you call that number, mm. someone must pick it. Okay. And then respond to you, very politely. And then the customer relationship with us because, <coughs> in a tour and travel industry, it's the hospitality industry. I must check on you, how are you faring, how are you doing? Because it's very sad to, to have a client and then you don't, you don't check on them. Yeah. And then, then that's, that's, that's not the, the purpose of, of doing the business. Mm. So our, our, um, our reputation or our, our self as Boone Safaris, even now my clientele can tell you, I, mean, I do like uh, reaching out to my clients. Wherever they're in the trips, wherever I'm not there, I do call, have you, have you arrived? Is everything okay? Yeah. It's good to check on them. Right. Yeah, that, that brings the trust and the, the friendship and the, with the company with and with their clients. Mm. Yes. That's a good one because I can only imagine if Safaricom gave you a call every morning. Hi, Sanko, how are you? <laughs> are you? How is your mental well-being? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> very few companies do that. And if you're doing that, that's incredible. Yeah. Okay. Really incredible. Thank you. Really incredible. You. And uh, so far, who are your like, main uh, target uh, clients? Mm. Maybe do you have like an age bracket or judging mm. from what you've experienced with your clients, mm -hmm. uh, maybe their age bracket, um, how is there also the economic status no. uh, in terms of, so of also gender, who are some of the people that are considering travel a lot right now, now that this is best in Kenya? Uh -huh. hey, that one, uh, okay, my, my, age, my age bracket for, because I don't have age, because uh, sometimes I do take kids. Mm. I, I oh, do so have, it's I, like general. Type yeah, it's of general. It's general. Okay. Yeah, I do take some grannies. I do take some old people. So it's general. Yeah. I cut across it's because we do uh -huh. have a, a favorable package for every uh, for right. everybody. Yeah, yeah, and then um, uh, the <laughs> the we don't we don't, we don't, uh, at Ubag, we don't have yeah. any, any, if it's the schools we do the schools. If uh -huh. it's uh, big people, right. and then the the say the gender 
of course ladies ladies oh, ladies, ladies uh, do a lot of travels uh, they, they, they do like yeah. and right. yeah is it because men do not have money Am uh, I, no, no. the economy is not economy <laughs> actually actually many 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 ladies i think i don't i don't want to say that one but uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It only later, Vita. But even okay. even men, men, I think uh, I don't know. But uh, with time, yeah. But for me, at least I do have a, a balance. You I have do a have a balance, balance of both. Yeah, yeah. I do a balance of both genders, but females they are on top. Right. You yeah. mentioned about packages, and maybe yeah. uh, if you could mention to our viewer, maybe what are some of the packages that you have at your uh, company, and maybe what is the cheapest, what is the most expensive, and also in terms of destination, maybe which one is the most exotic that you'll take them to. Uh, exotic, of course, is uh, the cost. We have the cost. We have that's the, in Kenya. That in Kenya, in Kenya, we have uh, even Nairobi. Nairobi, Nairobi, Nairobi. It's a uh, the main hidden gems here in Nairobi. Yeah, I'm True, very I sure agree. even I can take you to a place. Is, is yeah. he in Nairobi? Yeah, I remember last week I had the, the same same conversation with the previous guest, and he was he was like, "There's places you've never been to in this country." Yeah, sure. And the day you'll be there, you'll wonder what you've been doing. I'm telling in this you, country. I, I can give yeah. you a challenge. Just take like a like a four weeks drive from right. Nairobi to Kakamega. Yes. Go through those counties, I'm telling you, be just yeah. amazed. So many places. You'd be amazed, I'm telling you. Uh -huh. So uh, in Kenya, for instance, we have a, the lowest package right now we have, it's uh, Suswa. We do have this trip to Suswa, where right. you experience three tunnels. Do you know that Kenya, we have three tunnels? Wow. You experience okay. three tunnels mm -hmm. uh, in one day. Yeah. So you go to Ngong Tunnel using right. the SGR. That is using the SGR. The SGR. So you're offering the clients all that in terms of transport, booking, everything, everything for us. Food, accommodation, and all that. Yeah, for for that one, for that one is is a, is a day. We do have a different. We do have a a day trip, and we ah. do have a, those um, the like two sleeping. You understand? But for that one is a, is a day trip. Mm. That uh, imagine with the low than two thousand two hundred. You are good right. to go, and then you enjoy the three, three tunnels. You enjoy the to we offer the transportation, the round transfers from yeah. Suswa to Nairobi come by the road. So you oh. get the two things. Oh, SGR, Kwenda, Kurudi. Kwenda, Kurudi, Nagari. All right, that's and then a good uh, one. there's there's lunch mm -hmm. there for you. Right. There's water there for you. There's right. photography, of course, for memories. Right, don't right. forget that. Mm -hmm. And then uh, for for oh, that goes for how much? Two thousand one hundred ninety nine shillings. Two thousand only. Good luck. Only. Okay. And uh, which is uh, next uh, on fourth on fourth Feb, mm -hmm. and then we do have uh, for Mombasa. Mombasa we have Valentine package, mm -hmm. uh, for as low as seventeen thousand five hundred. Yeah. And yeah. which which spots in coast specifically? Um, we, we are going to the north the north coast at the Serena Serena. Can I say the, the yeah? Arena? Sure, absolutely. Ser sure. Serena sure. Beach the Serena Beachfront apartments. Mm -hmm. They are actually those are the luxurious apartment in uh, Shanzu. Uh -huh. Yeah. Right. The, yeah. We be, actually we have been doing it. For this will be our second edition. Last year it was magical. It was so big right. because uh, at least with time God God has helped me. I had many clients from Uganda. Right. So oops, this year we have many. The booking so far that good. That uh, uh, package comes at seventeen thousand. Then we have oh, of, oh, 17? seventeen thousand five hundred. Right. And uh, transport is by SGR or fl flight. So that one, that one you're using the the package there. The, it's very magical because we have a uh, transport to and fro. We have accommodation per person sharing. Our we accommodation per person. Per person sharing. Single. Uh -huh. Yeah, and then we we have uh, we have the food. The right. the meal the meal plan is a half board. That's breakfast and dinner. Right. And then we have activities. Activities now we have this visitation to Fort Jesus. We have to right. go to this Hala Park. And right. Then uh, we do have uh, the big the crown moments, the yacht party, where right. we take our clients at least experience that uh, yacht thing. Other right. going to Dubai, you can enjoy that one in Mombasa. Right. Uh, yeah, we do right. that. So that one is inclusive of the seventeen thousand five hundred. Right. Yes. Is that a place where you're offering maybe in terms of transportation now? Like, for example, if a client uh, mainly wants flight uh -huh. as their means of transport. Mm -hmm. yeah. F okay, for, for that one, we, we, do, we, do, we do have a case. For instance, uh, we do have some, maybe a client doesn't want to use the SGR. Yeah, we can, we can organize that one on a, on a personal level when you can contact us you know, individually. We yeah. can organize that one. But for the package, it's the SGR. Yeah. Yes. Uh, sorry, continue. <laughs> yeah, and then uh, we do have the Zanzibar, the Zanzibar right. trip. Uh, yeah, that one, that one we did last year, and then this one also we're doing it. That one goes at 59,999 shillings. That's almost 60,000. It includes uh, air travel? Or Everything. It, it includes, the, the package includes the accommodation, the transportation, right. the food, uh, the activity, because uh, that journey, sometimes I do, I do like, 
telling people it's good to take the adventure walk. Adventure walk by this I mean it's good to use by the road because on the road you you see magical things, and that's the yeah. purpose of the adventure. Because uh, if uh, if you are a travel enthusiast, you need right. to to have that that can I say nja yeah ya kuona mingi right yeah, yeah. so for the Zanzibar one last year we we did a flight. No flight, sometimes you just sit then you're in Zaziba and then enjoy. But right. this one for this year, I said uh, it's good we use uh, the road and right. then come back with the flight. Right. So it's good. Uh, so we use uh, by the road, we go by the road. Right. Then after Zanzibar, we come back with the flight. Right. Yes. So there's a difference between the lowest package and uh, maybe you can also strike yeah, the difference. Yeah, okay. And then the our most package. Most expensive and the yes. affordable one. Okay. Our packages are, depends on your pocket. Oh, we, we, do, we don't have a specific okay. one. For you, ah. maybe for instance, someone wants a wants a package. We just uh, our sales rep. We just take you through. Right. Then we'll understand like what do you want. First right. of all, we'll ask you what do you want because right. uh, we must work within your budget. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So for us, I, I can't say like we have the exact uh, package uh, price for for our clients. No, depends with your mfukwa Yeah. Yes. Because uh, when you look at it, uh, for example, if somebody, I don't know if somebody from the village would want to travel mm -hmm. to, mm -hmm. you know, reach out to you and say they want to travel to another destination. <laughs> I don't know if it's possible, but I know it is possible. Yeah, it is. It but is. Uh, you realize also it's most of the people who are traveling are, are also people from the urban areas. Yeah. But f actually for, my, for, my, for myself or for my story, it's very different because I do have class from back in our village home. Oh, wow. Uh -huh. I have, I have, I have, actually I have like almost like I think six, yeah, six and the couples, right. they always support me. They come mm -hmm. all the way from Igori, right. just to come to, to go for these Mombasa, Diani, you saw these trip staycations in Nairobi, right. yeah. Right. So for us we, do, we don't have like, a, it's a, regardless, either we're from Mushags, Nairobi, yeah. our package depends on you, whatever you want, we offer for you. Right, yeah. and later on you'll tell us how people can get to access your business and also get to travel with you. Oh, but maybe you can shift away now from your individual experiences. Maybe let's take a look at now just the general tours and travel industry yeah. at large. Uh, when you look at uh, the current uh, government that we have right now, mm -hmm. uh, maybe what are some of the measures that you have identified as uh, a person running the business that maybe are helping you in, 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 that, spec in, in that spectrum as well as maybe just that tours and travel space at large? Mm -hmm. Number one, of course, the, the whatever the president did for making Kenya visa free yeah. is benefiting well, to our that's business. That's benefiting to you. That, that of right. course, if someone can, can jump that one, I think is... Uh, so the, when the president said that Kenya now is a, is a visa free, right. at least we, we, can, we have received, for, for my sake, we have received many calls, maybe asking like, hey, which are the best destination to visit this year, right. which are the, the, the best rates. Right. Yeah, I, actually, I've received... Uh, there's someone who wants to come or oh, just to visit Kenya to go like different county. You want you want to go to Mombasa, Nairobi, and Kisumu, and then go back. Right. So that one has has increased the the rates of inquiries. Yeah. And then uh, number two, the government has uh, at least I can see they are trying to to promote our the magical Kenya phrase. You know, let me tell you something. Uh, there's a country in Africa. I can in East Africa that is I don't know if I can mention it. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, a country like Rwanda. You know, Rwanda. Rwanda, the visit Rwanda hashtag, you know, the visit yeah, Rwanda, it's a, it. it's a campaign. Yeah. Right. That campaign, the Rwandan government has And why can't we have similar to, like that, that to Kenya? Actually, why I'm, don't I'm we just praying that the CS, yes. Dr. Mutua, kindly. Right. Number one is kize. It's good to mm. use this magical Kenya. Because when you see right. visit Rwanda, when, uh, mm. when, you, when you walk in the streets of Dubai, when you walk in the streets of uh, Doha, you see yeah. people wearing these jerseys for Arsenal. I, I'm sorry to right. say so. Yeah. And then the, uh -huh. the brand. So many people say, right. okay, visit Rwanda, what's this? Mm -hmm. If we can have that one for the magical Kenya, because I'm, I'm very sure uh, Kenya has the best sites, right. I think, in the world. That is. Yeah. Because Kenya is the only country, I'm right. Nairobi is the only city in the world with right. the national park. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. But when you see other countries which uh, they're using their, their tourism board funds very well, Right. They are they are promoting their country, but for for Kenya, of course, Kenya we are trying. That's, that's what I'm telling you. The, for instance, like uh, last week, we had uh, this iFly Dubai. Right. It, it made a direct flight from Dubai to Mombasa. Yes. That one, th of course, that opened uh, doors mm. for for visas to come. Right. 
So right. the, 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 the ministry is trying, the government is trying yeah. to do all it can right. to, to make our, our business flourish. Yeah, but right. yeah. And that's really interesting because also we argued, I think last year, we were like, the visa free thing mm -hmm. is not secure. <laughs> but then, yeah. you know, it's good to hear from you who is in their space and yeah. you can tell from experience, which mm -hmm. is really incredible. Yeah, because because we, some some clans uh, maybe they are from South Africa, so they, they usually fear like, okay, should should we come with the what's the requirements? Need? Yeah. No, since they we don't have those visas, at least now they started inquiring. At least now they can. Of course, there's some small share, there's some, some small fee, right. at least which is favorable for them. Right. Yes. Right. Uh, when you check on the stats, uh, you realize South Africa is like one of the most. Uh, a market, uh, one of the most marketed countries uh, mm -hmm. in terms of yeah. tourism, in terms of even advertisements, even on digital and on even digital. TV, mm -hmm. uh, South Africa is on top. Uh, but now when you compare that to our country, Kenya, if maybe you were to address uh, some of the missing links mm -hmm. uh, that uh, maybe not favor uh, mm -hmm. local tourism or mm -hmm. domestic tourism uh, as we exit, maybe what are some of the things you'd address? Or if you had to speak to C.S. Alfred Mutua and you were to communicate to him and tell him, we need this and this in place mm -hmm. to boost domestic tourism. What are some of those things that you'd point out to him? Okay, <laughs> number one, I, I have, I have, I have a lot, but uh, to the CS, also the government, that is, you no, know, a country like Rwanda, a country like South, South Africa, they have used a lot in uh, marketing the their brand, and that is uh, our brand in Kenya is magical Kenya. Let's try to invest more. Let's try to. To, to do some uh, these promos because uh, for real I, I can I can't remember the last time I saw even the advertisement of Kenya Airways I don't I'm a, uh, I mean uh, I'm a TV station but I can see it for for real because when you go to other countries you see the these airlines being advertised but for Kenya I can't see it there's a there's an advert which went uh, viral yeah. that's for the advert of 19 I think 1999 for Kenya Airways it was all about these jungle lions, elephants, that thing was making people to say, hey, I need to go to this country because already they have their, their, their career, so it's easier. So for this government, kindly, it's good to invest more on the marketing of the, and the awareness of our, what our country holds because our country holds a lot of heritage and a lot right. of magical, magical things, I can say so. Yeah. Yes. And that's, that's a big investment. Yeah. Because also when you look at uh, some of the selling points, and maybe you can also point out maybe what are some of the selling points for our country, Kenya. And also uh, for anybody maybe who's watching yes. uh, from outside country and mm -hmm. they want to visit Kenya, mm -hmm. if you were to assure them and convince them that if you come to Kenya, mm -hmm. you'll be rest assured to enjoy this and this in terms of Seattle is to Mombasa because mm -hmm. a lot of people just say, oh, it's Mombasa and mm -hmm. the sandy beaches. But there's a lot even right here in Nairobi, even in Kakamega, sure. you had mentioned that. Sure, sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, first of all, when you just arrive at JK, when, when you take your lunch maybe at the Ole Sereni, it's good to take a walk to yeah. the Nairobi National Park. It's just yeah. here, I think some few kilometers. So in Kenya, we have many, many locations. Just live around even the, the coast. In Meru alone, we have the Rhino Camp, which is very, very unique. You understand? In uh, Nanyuki, we have Ole, Ole Pejeta. You yeah. understand? In uh, Nakuru, we have the Lake Na Nakuru. Right. Naivasha, we have Lake Lamentator, which has the hot spring. Go right. to Bogoria. Go to, in, uh, actually in Naivasha alone, we have, uh, we have the lake, the Lake Naivasha. We have the Great Lakes. We have, uh, we have these uh, hot springs lake. We have the National Park there, the Lake Nakuru National Park. Right. Uh, when you go to Kisumu, we have Kiniroma. We have the Dunga Beach. We have yeah. the Hippo Center. Right. Yeah, when you go to Kamega, we have this big forest. We have the, the crying stone. It's good. Kenya, 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 Kenya has uh, good sites right. for for adventurers. I can't say so. So right. it's good. Uh, it's good when you come. We have uh, we have a lot in Kenya. Actually, I can, I can tell you for free. You can't name all whatever we have because we haven't mentioned Samburu. Haven't yeah. Samburu alone. Uh, I think Samburu should be the top. This year, it should be the top, I think, the town of attraction because it has the national park, it has the Buffalo Spring, yeah. and the safari to Sambur is just amazing. Right. Yeah. Right. So it's not just Mombasa. No, it's not Mombasa. Best holiday destination. Yeah. 
Yeah. But also I think it depends because, you know, the way Mombasa has been glorified as the <laughs> best holiday <laughs> destination, mm -hmm. it gives uh, uh, Kenyans uh, the curiosity. Yeah. I just want to go to the Mombasa and get to the beach. Is, but also, uh, I, d I don't know if there's a beach in Naivasha. At least yeah. Naivasha. I've, I've not been there, to be honest, all my <laughs> life. And I usually feel guilty. I need like, to take why you. haven't I been there? I promise so you. So I was like, if you want to go to Mombasa, why can't you also go to Naivasha? Yeah. Like, alternate these places. See Mombasa to Pekeake. Uh, Even though it's still part of Kenya, anyways. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, you see, be there for real. No, no, I can. Mombasa, Mombasa. Of course, Mombasa is a good place. I can't, I can't deny. Mombasa is good. Diani is good. Wow. The North Coast and South Coast, they're all good. Yeah. You see? But go to this place. This, uh, can I say, they're not abandoned. Now, but then nowadays, when you go right. to this, even Naivasha, right. they have started as saying, okay, this, this is like a tourist attraction because uh, when you go to like Naivasha, for instance, we have the, cra the Crescent Island. Yeah. You know, that place has zebras. Actually, yeah. let me tell you a funny thing. My yeah. holiday, I didn't go to Mombasa. I went to Naivasha. Right. Naivasha is such amazing. Yeah. There's, a, there's a good hotels where you can just sleep with a very affordable and then right. enjoy the maximum view yes. of uh, the lake. And yeah. uh, a beach, remember, a beach is just the showbiz mm. of a, 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 a yeah. very basin water. So yeah. that is, uh, in Naivasha also we have beach. Yeah. We have the, we have a Kendera beach. We right. have a public beach yeah. where people can go, do right. a boat riding. Yeah. yeah. So Naivasha, Naivasha, Nakuru, yeah. good places to go. And I think it's also it's also an, an ideology that should be cultivated so that yeah. people can do away with ah it's just Mombasa, but also the good part is you get to interact with people from different cultures. Yeah. They speak Swahili. Their mm -hmm. food stuff yeah. is just amazing. Mahamri's mm -hmm. and the pilaus <laughs> is also in terms of food. By the how do you also uh, cushion your clans in terms of food and whatnot? Because that includes uh, the safety part. Mm -hmm. You know you're likely to fall victim of food poisoning yeah. or an attack. You know somebody mm -hmm. could be at the park and. You know, I don't know if you do the zip lining. Mm -hmm, yeah, yeah, we do. You, you've done that. Uh -huh. That's risky for me. My heart will be palpitating. <laughs> like I'm trying to imagine the worst if this thing cuts off. So if, for example, if a client gets injured during mm -hmm. that process, how do you caution them? No, before before even doing that uh, challenge, uh, I think, we're, for instance, we have Brudani. There's a, there's a place in the Limuru. Yeah. When you go to do such activities, you're given some, uh, can I say, cautions? or right. pre precautions, or can be, there's some rules you're given, then you sign. Right. So you must be cautious when you're signing those, those things. Right. And then uh, going to the food. Uh, as as Bundi Safaris, we do try as, uh, as much as possible that all, all our, maybe these private chefs or our hotels, they have the good, uh, the good um, reviews for their food. And so far so good, since I started my company, I haven't had any complaint about the food. Right. Yeah, because you need to. The first thing I do tell people, jali tumbe amwenzako. Yeah. When when you when you take care of the good thing about you, when I take care of you, right. you'll appreciate me. Yeah. Yeah. What of those rowdy clients who like they booked today and mm -hmm. tomorrow they're cancelling? How do you also <laughs> deal with that? <laughs> or just there's pe pe there's people go through things. Yeah. There's, oh yeah. There's sure. good days and bad days. Mm -hmm. And there's those clients who are like their personality is just everywhere. Today, I know I'm a cashier, I'm a and I'm a halfway and I'm a council, and sometimes they give feedback. So, how do you also process that negative feedback and positive? Okay, okay. For for Bundi Safaris, uh, we do have our terms and condition. Why? No, yeah. Maybe you can state like our terms example. and condition is all the payments are non-refundable, but they can oh. be used. Oh, they can be used. They can be used in a span uh -huh. of one year. Actually, actually, I, ha I have a trip, and uh, right. these even my viewers can comment in your in your social yeah, media. Absolutely. I, 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 do, I do. I do. I have. I have almost like a, my first trip. The, these for Susua. Yeah. I think I have almost like a, is it four? Four all clients. Right. All these clients they booked last year, but didn't manage. But uh -huh. because they had booked, yeah. and the year hasn't elapsed, so they right. still. They can still go So our term and condition is all okay. payments are non-refundable, right. but they can be utilized. In one year. Oh, that's the disclaimer. Yeah. Refundable, but that's can be utilized. <laughs> but why can't you just refund? Maybe somebody is broke <laughs> <laughs> or a situation came up because there's usually, you know, I don't know if you've ever paid for an event mm -hmm. and they're like, no, please just return the money I'll do next month. You know, some things come up. <laughs> okay, so, how you know, do you help mm, out now? That one, that one is a bit tricky because uh, when, when, uh, when planning, you know, you need to do some bookings. Because right. uh, remember, when you don't sleep in a hotel, either you have slept or you haven't slept. It, it has already been counted for. Right. So maybe you had booked maybe to go to Diani. Right. You understand? And then maybe the last meaning cancellation. Okay, right. we do have a we, we can we can we do cancellations here. Right. But not uh, not uh, two weeks before the 
the, 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 the trip. Right. We can do the cancellation, but uh, for me, haven't experienced such. Yeah. But that's of course the, there must be some. Right. But for them, uh, if you cancel, maybe last minute, I'm sorry. Yeah. So yeah. like uh, the trip is eleven. Eleven. And you're then canceling now. Ah uh, no. Just few. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But uh, yeah. that that uh, that money can be used. Yeah. That can be, can be used for you in the, in the next uh, event. Right. Yeah. And reviews, do you have clients giving reviews and saying, hmm, I had the best experience. The results, even if it was the best, they will never say <laughs> anything positive. They're uh, like, actually, ah, <laughs> maybe you can point out and just uh, uh, let our viewer know maybe some of the reviews that you received. Oh, yes. So for, for instance, we, I did, uh, I did uh, Arusha trip. Right. Bukamwaka, that is, I did in uh, 31st. I went to Aru Moshi, then we went to Arusha, and then right. came back to Kenya. It was a three, two days trip. The reviews, actually, I have them in my phone because me, yeah, I do Sure, you can point out uh, before we let end me. It. So the, the, the trip is when, when you see someone telling you that, uh, thank you so much, the trip was so magical, I appreciate everything. At least th that one gives you the, the, the psych and the morale of doing whatever you do. So yeah, and even, even 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 sometimes we do get even good reviews from the hotel which you have spent there right. because if if your clients are the the good no damages cost, right? They must say you guys, it's amazing. Yeah, yeah, and even our pages don't lie because in our Instagram, in our Facebook, we have numbers and we have comments there. Yeah. So yeah, we do have. Yeah. So uh, also two questions and then we go. Yes, please. Uh, how do clients uh, reach out to you? Uh, maybe have you? made use of the digital space yeah, yeah. and also you can <coughs> explain and expound a little bit how has the digital space influenced or hastened business mm -hmm. for the tours and travels industry wow okay so uh the digital space has helped me i think uh every 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 business is using the digital space even the tv is a digital thing so now for for us uh, our social media that is instagram facebook uh TikTok, it has oh, helped. On TikTok as well. Oh, we are yeah. on TikTok, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Everywhere there. So, through our contents, through whatever we post, through yeah. our um, class review, from right. even our class tagging us. So, right. we get some referrals from there. Actually, many, many, many of our bookings, right. many of our bookings, we do them online. We do right. them uh, We do them through our website. We have a website that is right. www.bundisafaris.co.ke. Okay. Yeah. So, when you go there, these are our packages. You just select them from then one, one, one of us will take through and then can help you go. That means it's an active uh, website it and, is. and social media it because is. you can't just create a website and you go and sit back. It means sure. you spread awareness on it mm -hmm. and people have hard time to interact with it and even know how to navigate. Yeah. Yeah. It's, 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 it's a very, it's, a, it's, a, it's an easy website when you just go, right. where you type where you, where you do want to go, yeah. days you want to spend, right. blah, blah. When you click that send message, you to come to our info, info right. at uh, our email, that is. Right. Then one of us will call you because we must provide your number so at least we yeah. can reach you or right. your email. Absolutely. Yes. So for anyone who will reach out as you're talking right now, maybe mm -hmm. what is the first thing or what is the first icon that mm -hmm. will land on, on that website? Or maybe also your Instagram. What is the first photo? Because, you know, this is a digital space. It's yeah. all about videos. Mm -hmm. It's all about photos, photos yeah. audio, sound. Yeah. Exactly. So actually, when, when you go to our website, the first thing you see there is our our photos. Then there down is it. Uh, we, we we have a, we have a, we have a, we have an icon of the WhatsApp, yeah. which says travel with us. So yeah. when you click that travel with us, it takes to WhatsApp. Yes. Then it will ask you like, where do you want to travel? So you yeah. send that message to us. From there, we'll get back to you. Right. Yeah. From there, now we start conversing with you, talk to you, discuss with you, then plan a good plan for you. Right. Going to the, our our digital space that is Instagram, the right. social media social media space that is Instagram. Uh, we do have a for it, for now we have a we have a good number in our Instagram. That's that's like our our big platform right now for Bundi Safaris. Right. We, all, we have. Oh, how many followers do you got? That that thirteen point two. 30,200 plus there. Mm, that's quite massive. How did you get that? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I tell you, when you're uh, doing this business, create good content. Uh, on, on your clients, give them that uh, opportunity to share your page. Then uh, when they're tagging, the, when they're on those trips, they yeah. tag our page. So friends, friends, to say, oh, that's, that's cool. Yeah. yeah. So right. that, that's how we, we grew our, our page. And our page is active. Actually, it's active right, right. now. Very active. Yeah, that active. means post posts are being 
updated each and every time. Each and every time. Right. Second yeah. last question. Mm -hmm. Do you think Kenyans travel a lot and maybe what are some of the best uh, places to travel and also the best time to travel? If, do we even have the best time to travel? So we I think it depends. Mm -hmm. You have the money even right now. Go to Dubai if you want. <laughs> okay, that, that, that's, for, that's for real. So <coughs> our, uh, I will start with the season. No, in right. traveling we don't have seasons uh, right. because for me that's, that's that's for me. I don't I don't others. But uh, if one if, if you're a travel enthusiast, if you want to go to maybe to to Nanyuki today and right. you have the you have the everything you, you have contacted us, we have given you the package. Right. We will 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 take you to Nanyuki and right. enjoy and enjoy your stay there. Right. You, you see, and then. Uh, uh, I think th 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 this this space, this uh, this space uh, in Kenya. I don't I, I can't tell you that this is the best destination to go. Right. Kenya is magical. I can take you even to Kisi. Yes. Even or Kisi. Or to Or to Migori. Yeah. Yeah. I can take you to Migori. Are there best places that in you identified for yourself? Oh yeah, Migori. Migori. Yes, we have we have river there. We have that uh, river Migori. That's the biggest. The, oh, we I have know. the river there. We have if you want to see to see the sugar plantation, it's there in Sony right. on your way to Migori. And then yeah. uh, we'll take you to the border. And then before even reaching to Migori, we have the there's in between there Rongo. There's some mm, there. Yeah. There's like some crafting of the, the stones there. The called Rongo. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I. I think each and every town in Kenya has its own, um, can I say, site of attraction. Yeah. Right. Kenya itself is, is a tourist attraction. Thank <laughs> Even you. the people. <laughs> Thank you know, you. I think it's Gabara Sakaji who said the best assets for Kenyans are the people. Yeah. I think he said he was giving Nairobi the best assets for the cities, the people of Nairobi. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. And then yeah. uh, I had forgot, sorry. Uh, and then you have talking about Sakaji, I've remembered. Okay. You asked the what can the government do to right. to, to, sure, to market sure, sure. to market the the, the, Kenya, the sites in Kenya? You see the governor, the governors, mm. they should take that as their first priority. Right. You see each and every governor. For instance, in uh, Homa Bay, you see like Homa Bay, the governor is trying to do this uh, her own uh, right. expo for her own county. I yeah. haven't seen that. But mm. now, if uh, this county is Kisi, Nyamira, even yeah. Nyamira has a good site. It has some right. waterfalls. It has some woody yeah. plantation. If yes. someone wants to go and see the green thing. Banana uh, plantation, go, go to Nyamira, go to Kisi. Yeah. I think these, these, these are called for all Kenyans. Uh, Kenyans. Mm. Mm -hmm. Even even these young 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 kids, because I remember yeah. when I, when I was in school, in I think it was it ge geography. Yeah. To look at Nafunzo Izima Izima, unambua kamani hills, how many hills Kenya zikonayo, right. such thing. If we embrace that. I'm telling yeah. you, we'll be our own ambassadors. I thought I these big yeah. celebrities to do our, 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 our yeah. advertisements. I remember previously had uh, the American supermodel Naomi Campbell, who was trying to, and then there was word to have Lupita Nyong'o, but then it and never happened. Happy, so. Yeah. So, but, now but why should we go for them? Why can't we go for you, who has yeah. a safari <laughs> travels company? Thank you, because yeah. uh, it's us to, to embrace our, ourselves, and uh, it's good to love Kenya, you know. First of all, if if uh, if you love your your country, if you love your homeland, right. you or your motherland, right. you'll be eager to advertise it. You good to to show it without any fear. Actually, I think it's a. Uh, but now the Kenya has changed the trend. People now are starting to love in Kenya because Kenya Kenya is being loved. But yeah. outside there, this this few people they tarnish being the Kenya is not a, a very good place. Kenya is a very very good place. Right. And v and Kenya. I thank God that Kenya we don't experience such seasons. I can tell you that oh, it's uh, Kenya. Kenya is uh, for everyone. Everyone coming all over from the world. Right. Kenya is very favorable. Akuna juu mingi sana. Akuna baridi sana. It's there. Yani umetulia tu yani. Kenya Kenya ni nyevi umesema it's a a tourist attraction. Kenya itself. Right. Yeah. Right, and it's time for us to leave. So I want you to convince our viewer and also mm -hmm. your followers mm -hmm. why it is important for them to travel and yeah. just get out of wh where you stay, exit the house, and <laughs> even take a walk to a different place. If you stay in Karen, please go to Kibra. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you stay in Kibra, try go to Nairobi <laughs> National Park. Yeah. Don't just get stuck where you are. At least get to know. So convince uh, your followers and your viewers mm -hmm. and the people that are watching that. The reason you need to travel mm -hmm. is this and that, and you need you need this. Also, tell them if where they can access your services, and also the reason why they should use your services as a tours and travels uh, assisting company. This is your camera as we exit. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, as I said, Bundi Safaris. I will start with the with our contact. Uh, Bundi Bundi Safaris can can get us across all our social media platforms. That's Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. Twitter, which is X, at Bundi Safaris. Then uh, we have our website, that is www.bundisafaris.co.ke. 
and then our email is info at uh, bundisafaris.co.ke. Uh, the reason why you should get out of your, can I say, comfort zone to travel, traveling makes you uh, learn more, and then adventure is, uh, is a very big place where you can enjoy yourself, then can, it can make you uh, connect with the nature, because nature is so sweet. And then um, uh, traveling with the Wounded Safaris and Bowen, uh, you should choose us. We are, we are affordable. I can say we are affordable because uh, we do packages regarding to your, to your specific uh, uh, packages which you want, that is. So we are pocket friendly. And then uh, Bundi Safaris, uh, we are accessible. You can uh, meet us in town uh, there. We have, we, we have an office there. And then, uh, of course, when you, when you call our numbers, you are easy. You, uh, any of the best people you can call and then enjoy the conversation till to the uh, end of your trip is Bundi Safaris. Yes. All right. And I think I don't want to add anything there. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, Thank you so much. For, <laughs> Thank you so from much for having me. Center. Karibu sana. And I should take you to Naivasha. You should take me to Naivasha. I, I feel guilty. Me. I mentally feel guilty. But I take you to Mombasa. Now that I... <laughs> think about that. <laughs> you got me. So, so thank you so much. Uh, oh. This is Ezra Bundi Obongo. He's the director at Bundi Safaris. That name, Bundi is, okay. It's creative from, I think your name, yeah. right? Actually, I did, I did say, sorry, a minute? Uh, sir, sir, not a minute, 20 seconds. 20 seconds. So actually, Bundi, Bundi Safari is my name. It's my name. I'm Ezra Bundi. So right. Bundi's, yeah. Bundi's, Bundi, mm. Ezra, and then I just removed the RA. So Bundi okay. Safari. So it's, it's my name. It's my Right. It's official name. Registered. You have registered. Just in case you mi you do some mess ups, you can be arrested. Don't dare. So, so we take a break. Stephanie Ayeta is going to be coming up with a conversation about uh, mental and physical wellness in just a bit. But continue to interact with us on the hashtag, which is why in the morning at Y254 channel, everyone on our social media platforms and mine personally is at Brian Sakwana One. We take a break. We come back with much more. Stick around. Thank you.